but this one is not beautiful. And what's the name of this area? This is Rose Garden area. Rose Garden. Old houses here. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So, like I said, first companies, I mean, IT companies, was eBay, HP? Well, uh, HP is one of the first. Uh, uh, there was... Um, Sorry? You look a little bit turned down. This? Uh -huh. eBay? eBay was one of the first. And, IBM? Uh, well, IBM was definitely the first. IBM was... New construction, so many. Yeah. IBM was definitely one of the first, so was Hewitt Packard. Apple actually got started and then they started to fall apart. Uh, and then really? Steve Jobs came back and... Reinvented? And, mm. uh, and reinvented them, so to speak. And from there, they just have gone. They've just exploded. They are the big company they are now, but they almost went bankrupt mm -hmm. for a while. Uh, eBay got started over there in Campbell. In uh, Campbell? Mm-hmm. Not San Jose? Not ah, in San Jose. Uh, well, actually, it's a, San Jose. It's a portion of San Jose, mm -hmm. but it's right outside of Campbell. Mm -hmm. Close to our meeting in uh, Campbell, yes? Close uh, to yeah. Mm -hmm. I went there. And then Google, and right now Google has another well, Google, project. Google is actually relatively new, I mean, at least in my, from my viewpoint, because there was applied materials used to be really big. Um, there was, um, like I said, Cisco got started. They were huge. Uh, then Google and Facebook both came on about the same time. Mm hmm But then I haven't even started naming off any of the high tech uh, medical companies. Medical? Because, yeah, because really? there's you know there's biotech that is you know pretty big in this area too. Although most of the bigger you know Genentech, Genentech, and and some of those companies those are those are actually more up in in the uh, uh, South San Francisco area. Um, but I mean talking about that, you've got Oracle, which is just huge up there. Um, mm -hmm. Larry Ellison's place. So, and other different companies and a lot of startups, of course. Uh, nowadays, that's that's what everybody does. You know, they got I mean, uh, Lyft and Uber just went, you know, IPR, Lyft went IPO, initial public offering. Mm -hmm. Never made any money. Don't plan on making any money, and they're a twelve billion dollar company. Airbnb, the same. Airbnb is, I don't know that they're public yet, but uh, at some point perhaps they will be. Mm -hmm. But you see what's happened with local people. No money for gas, you see, Austin. Yeah. But local people are going broke. Well, because if you're not in IT industry, it's very difficult to survive. Yes. Right. I mean, the teachers and the janitors and the McDonald's workers, the grocery store people, mm -hmm. you know, they. They don't make the big bucks, and so yeah, it's a little harder for them. Mm -hmm. So, what do you think? What's your prediction about Silicon Valley? Because you're local, you're born here, yes, in Los Gatos, uh -huh. and you think what can happen? It, I think it will be completely IT area, or full of Asian people, Chinese, well, Indian. It, I mean, we've got a, a much greater population right now. That's for sure. Because but, of uh, H1B visa, yes, of course. Well, H-1Bs is, is a big portion of it. Mm-hmm. But Trump said. But the, <laughs> for, as far as I'm concerned, it's not the visas, it's the education. These are the educated people. We want those people here. Yes, but... Otherwise, we're not going to be able to sustain ourselves, and we're not going to be able to sustain San Jose. And like they were, you know, like some of what was being discussed there was the idea of new buildings, because the solution for the affordable housing is to build more houses not to do rent restrictions and stuff like that because uh, you need we need we just need more pro more available property all this section right here on Bascom Avenue that we're just about to pass mm -hmm. all of this is about to be redeveloped mm -hmm. and if you go down Stevens Creek this way mm -hmm. to Meridian you'll see what it's going to look like because back in this area down the street um, big local builder Barry Swenson built uh, some high-rises down there that are mixed use and that's what all of this area is going to be like too because this is all this is a huge 
this is pretty much a dead zone. Mm -hmm. Commercial. It's a dead commercial zone. Most of this stuff is, you know, outdated, mm -hmm. uh, outdated. old uh, businesses. And like, see all this area that's all fenced stuff? Mm -hmm. That's all vacant. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, there's nobody. Because cool. this, well, the city's already, you know, got plans on what they're going to do there. So they closed all that stuff out. Mm -hmm. And what will it be? It's probably going to be supply. Like this right over here, this big building over here, this is Valley Medical Center. Mm -hmm. That is, you know, that's the big central uh, hospital for our, uh, for San Jose. So all that's mm -hmm. probably going to be smaller doctor's offices and stuff like oh, that. We need more park. Could you take more park? Oops, because I forgot to take more park. That's, mm -hmm. also, that's okay. I know what to do. Mm -hmm. It's college and his medical center. Right. Yes, I know. But population is changing right now, yes? Mostly, yeah, but the, it's still it's still a growing population. What whatever the makeup of that population is is really to me it's unimportant because the that's the numbers of people that are here. And as long as we have, I mean, Apple still has another campus to build out here in North San Jose. Mm -hmm. uh, uh, Google. And Google plans Google. to build more downtown San Jose. Mm -hmm. So these the when station. they when they start building those things that's going to be uh, 50 or 60 